Good morning, guys, even though it's not really morning anymore. It's almost noon. <laughs> Come here. Drop the ball. Drop it. He's holding a ball, but he won't give it to me. So he's like whining because he wants me to throw it. But I can't throw it if you don't give it to me. So today, so far, I woke up at like 7.30, took him out, fed him, worked for just a few minutes, like 30 minutes. And then we took a nap on the couch. I woke up again, packed up my stuff, took another nap on the couch. <laughs> and now I'm getting ready to leave because the Richardsons will be back in not too long. I didn't want him to be, like I could have left already, but I didn't want him to be locked up for too long. So I'm just gonna get ready and going back to that elementary school to observe that teacher a little bit more today. And then I'll go home and work and maybe do some more nursery setup. I want to decorate for Christmas, but I know my top priority right now is getting her nursery everything ready. So we'll see what I end up doing today. Just brushing my hair. I just realized that I'm doing this in the kitchen. Um, I'm gonna go somewhere else to brush my hair. <laughs> I'm in the drive-thru at Jack in the Box. It's taking forever. I was trying to get to the school by one, just because that's when like, after her lunch break, when her next class starts. But my ETA is not quite one yet. <laughs> I mean, my ETA is 54, but I'm not gonna <clears throat> get through this drive through in five minutes. <laughs> so I'm definitely gonna get there after one. Thinking about not going today, cause it's only for like two hours anyway. And I'm gonna be there on Monday. I think I'm gonna text her and tell her that I'm, I'm just not gonna go today. I'm gonna open the package that I got yesterday that I didn't get a chance to open. There might be more mail today. This is yesterday's mail. <laughs> Oh, it's Pat Pat. Some cute clothes and things. So I got this like matching set for like a whole family. This material is awful, but I think it's okay. So there's a dress for me. It's tie up, so I'll be able to adjust it to whatever size I am. And then there's a little matching outfit for baby girl. It's a little jumpsuit, so cute. And then for Isaiah, t-shirt with the same color so we'll be matching. I don't know what specifically I got this for. It was just on sale for super cheap, so. A little dress, and it's tie-dye. I got myself one of these hair clips because I've been needing one, and they had it for like super cheap. I don't remember how much this stuff was, but I just know it was like really cheap. I got this canister of hair ties for little girls because they don't hurt their hair. Oh, it's a little one piece outfit thing. It unbuttons all from the bottom for diaper changes. Buttons I know people say are annoying. I'll probably just have her wear this during the day so that I don't have to do that buttons in the middle of the night. <laughs> this can um, go ahead and be washed. Oof, I missed. And then the shirt, it's a men's shirt. It was another one of those sets, but they were sold out of all of, like pretty much every size except for this one shirt for men's. And I just thought it was cute and it was only like $2, I think. So I went ahead and got it for Isaiah. It's like a pinkish orange and it has a really cute pocket. So if we go to the beach this summer. Next, we have another little baby outfit. Oh my gosh, it's so cute. It roughly goes in the front and then it like, I guess crisscrosses and ties in the back or something. I'll have to figure out the straps, but because it's open in the back and it's just like a little bloomer bottom that buttons at the bottom. And then it came with a little tie thingy like for like a headband. <laughs> so cute. Uh, a pack of white socks. These look really big. Like these look like they would fit me. <laughs> Definitely wouldn't fit me, but like she's not gonna fit these till she's like a toddler. What size is this supposed to be? Doesn't have a size, it just says five pack baby toddler socks. <clears throat> well, they'll get used eventually. I just really needed some socks for like a newborn baby. <laughs> these are like toddler. <laughs> The last thing, other than some stickers like last time. Little pink leggings. Oh wait, oh this is not leggings, this is, oh I'm excited about this. Look at this, it's a little headband with a knot in the front of it, a little donut knot. That is so cute and it's really stretchy, it'll fit her a long time. <laughs> That's so cute. Really soft too. That's everything from yesterday's package. I'm gonna go get some work done. Oh, by the way, I ended up not going to observe today. She said, <clears throat> since I was going to be getting there so late, she only has one class left, so she said just to come on Monday. 
Oh, I got so many cute things for her. I don't think anything in this package was a bust, actually. The last one I had that bag thing that was definitely a bust. Oh, I guess the socks you could consider a bust, but that's just because I ordered the wrong size, I'm sure. Um, and they'll get used eventually. They're just white socks. Okay, time for me to clean up the bump. Should we do a bump of the day? <laughs> I'm wearing sweats because <laughs> it's very uncomfortable to wear anything else. Here's how my bump is looking. Those stupid lines. Anyway, <laughs> lines won't go away, but it's how big it is. And it's really lopsided. <laughs> You will never see me dress like this in public, but I'm very pregnant and don't feel like messing with cute clothes right now. Stupid camera. Ugh, I can't get the lines to go away. Anyway, I have a package to open. Another one. I know I opened one earlier, but I got more mail. I bought these little newborn onesies from someone on Facebook. They're like gently used, I think. And they came with pants, and I don't have any pants for her. It was four newborn onesies and two pair of pants for $10. So there's this one, pink with hearts, floral one, bears on it, and then there's a gray one with pink trim. And the pants are pink footy pants, and then floral footy pants. And I'm sure these pants go with other stuff I have. So I'm going to wash these and probably add some of these especially these pants, to my uh, hospital bag because, or her hospital bag, <laughs> because I don't have any pants. It never hurts to have more onesies, but I guess it would hurt if she doesn't even fit in these, if she's a big baby, because they're teeny. Look how tiny they are. They're so little bitty. And it's been so warm lately, I really don't know if it's going to be cold by the time she gets here, because it's December 9th today, and it was in the 70s, and I was wearing shorts and a t-shirt outside. Who knows what the, what the weather's going to be like. I keep packing warm stuff. And then these two packages came in for Isaiah, and he mentioned to me earlier that he wanted me to open a package on camera, but I don't know which one it is, and he's hunting, so I can't call him, because I might scare away the animals. So I guess I'll open both. One of them is the one he wants me to open. The other one's just going to be some random thing. Hopefully I'll be able to tell. <laughs> and this would be the thing that is not... I'm sure that's not for me <laughs> to see. So I'm going to put that back. I don't even know what that is. Probably a gun thing. Sight mark. Yep, it's a gun thing. Okay, so it's not that one. So it's got to be the other one. Ooh. That's cool. So I think it's just a deck of cards, but they're Avatar themed. Oh, it's Uno! It's Avatar Uno! So I got cut off earlier because my SD card was full. I just spent a long time like making space, but I was talking about the cards. It's basically Avatar Uno. That's all there is to say about it. And I'm going to actually start editing some Vlogmas episodes because I've been procrastinating posting the outfit video the Shein maternity haul, and I think I'm just going to wait and post that later. I'm just going to get into the Vlogmas so I can start uploading those episodes. It's 10.30, so I probably won't get much done tonight. <laughs> Sue's back. back. Hello. Back. Back. Go again. Hi. Why are you back already? Because we're done. Did you get anything? No. Then you're not done. Hmm? Then you're not done. <laughs> you're not going to stay out late or anything? No, we got hungry. Bro, so did we, ended up, we ended up calling it. We're really close to. Oh, and there was lightning. Oh. Like, big boy lightning. Well, did you get something to eat? Did you oh, eat? Uh, Jaime's dad made us. Um, he smoked some meat for us. Oh, yum. It was so good. You like, didn't bring really me? Really good. Huh? Why didn't you bring me any? Because we ate it all. Oh, <laughs> rude. Don't worry, the dogs were mad we didn't give them any, too. <laughs> you got. You compare me to a dog? I didn't say it. <laughs> guess what I'm doing? Getting mad at me for comparing you to a dog? No, I guess what I was doing before you walked in. Vlogging? Mm. Applying for a job? No. Dang it. I need to do that. What? Editing vlogmas! Yay! Yay! <laughs> say bye. Bye. I just look so weird in this hat. <laughs> Good morning, kind of afternoon actually, it's like two. I slept in today, now I'm going to open packages. Um, because instead of doing it at the end of the day, I'm doing it now.
because tonight I'm going Six Flags with my in-laws. It's like holiday in the park and stuff, so I don't know what time we're getting home. Tomorrow, we're setting up the baby bed. <laughs> Isaiah finally brought it in here so I can put it together. We have four packages to open. Oh, also, I don't know if I mentioned it already, but our, our rocking chair did come in. We haven't set it up yet, so I might do that tomorrow too. Congratulations on your sweet baby girl. Blake, Callie, Lena, Nora, and Marco. There's the rest of that gift. If you saw me open the other day, I already... I got myself one of these, but they got me a second one. It's a multi-use cover for nursing, high chairs, car seat, all kinds of stuff. I wanted two black ones because black goes with everything. Yay, thank you for that. And then they also got, I was going to say us, but Isaiah will not be using this. <laughs> it's a uh, hand pump for manual breast. It's a manual breast pump. So I have an electric breast pump that I got, but I wanted a little manual one if I'm ever not feeling like pulling out that whole machine. If I can open it. This is taped like so good. <laughs> and these scissors don't quite fit. I also got my thank you cards in the mail. I ordered these last night and they're already here because Amazon's cool like that. This is from Alba Baby, a wet bag for the diapers to go in like a laundry basket. I also got some reusable nursing pads, which I ordered these before I got some as a gift. Oh, I almost threw that away. There's one more thing in here. What is this? It's a little mini wet bag. I guess it's for these. Last package. Yep, it's diapers. We got a pink one, a yellow one, a green one, a red one, a blue one. This, oh, I forgot I ordered this. I'm so excited. Look at that print. That is so cute. And then I got a bunch of different kinds of inserts, like a bunch of different kinds. Two newborn inserts, 16 regular inserts of different kinds. And these are kind of like smaller, but these, they button over so they get shorter and they're all used, which is actually good for inserts because the more used and washed they are, the more effective they are, so. And then I also got this teether because it was like a dollar. Okay, that's all the packages today. I'm gonna work for a little bit and then we're gonna go six flags. Isaiah's not going with us because he's lame. He's going hunting. Right, babe? Yeah. I decided to braid my hair and I finished working and we're about to take off. I'm wearing a hat because my hair is dirty and I don't have dry shampoo and I didn't have time to wash my hair. I'm wearing a scarf because it's a little bit chilly outside. Sweater dress. Here's today's bump. Almost 37 weeks. We'll be on Tuesday and today's Saturday. And then we're just wearing pantyhose and I'm going to wear some boots. It's the most wonderful time of the year. And Santa's got a toy for every good girl and good little boy. This show is a good show. Look at all those kids and children. Don't you play in a careful place. Walk in the wind for a little bit. Okay, so to all the adults in here, I'd like to offer you a drink. <laughs> and never mind, a couple of you 
were walking a bit funny on the way in here, so I put this to the side for now. But if I know not the game, you know, well, well, maybe if you fix my table, this wouldn't happen. Okay, it's not my fault the table is. Oh, it is your fault. You were the one that wanted to get the house with the horse foundation problems. What can you explain to these wonderful guests how you broke my table? I did not break your sink. Yes, you did. No, I put the sink together. Yeah, okay. But when I put it together, the instructions were upside down. So you broke it! No, I did not break it. It's a foundation issue. Do you know how hard it is to do the dishes with water splashing in your face? Yeah, you know. Speaking of splashing in your face, don't pee. No, he learned the hard way. Trust me. <laughs> I tell you what, they can take these uh, guests off your hand if you want to fix this in. Oh, please do! Yeah, I got less of room in here, guys. You know they gotta be like a bunch of cramped sardines stuck in the kitchen with him. Hola, amigos. Come on in, come on in. Now, I must say, watch out for the gaps right here. If you fall through, you might not ever make it out. That's how I ended up with a job. 12 years ago, I fell through that very gap, and I've been working here ever since. But my personal favorite thing about the Fiesta is always the food. Now, this is a little contraption I like to call a fruit roll-up. I call it fast food. Yeah, that one too. Now, uh, just like the Posada have room for Mother Mary and Joseph, we always have room for you guys in our hearts. Here, have an orange. <laughs> well, I don't want the orange in for you. I had like 20 of these today. Okay, well, you probably don't want this orange anyway. It's hard as a rock. You know, I've been this rock. Now, uh, one more thing before you guys go today. Something magical I found outside of the park. Something you might know as a compass. But not just any ordinary compass, no, it's special. It's Which broken. Is this coming? It's not broken. It is broken. I got it at the thrift store. It's not broken. Oh, it is broken. Now, uh, which way does this compass point for you guys? It points that way, yeah? Now watch very, very carefully as I turn the compass around. Now which way it points for you? Now how does that make sense, huh? Maybe it's uh, a trick up the sleeve. Maybe you weren't paying attention. Maybe it's the magic dust. Maybe it's Maybelline. Or I maybe it's broken. It's not broken. It is broken. No matter which way I turn this compass, it's always pointing in one direction. You know, like the fan. Even if I turn the entire compass around, you know what this means? This special compass, no matter what, it's not broken. It is this broken. compass will always point you in the right direction. Door six legs over Texas. And remember, Gracias, amigos. Thank you for coming to Casa Magnetica. And remember this, if you fall and get hurt on your way out, it's not our fault. No, it is his fault. <laughs> his name is Esteban. You can tell HR. Trust me. <laughs>
this room is not big enough for us to put a nursery with our bed. <laughs> She'll only be using this crib for naps because she seems to sleep in the bassinet overnight. So I can just put her in like right here because she'll be small and she won't be able to move around anyway. So even if the rocking chair sticks out this way. If I'd have known the shirt was right here on the chair, I would have put it on a long time ago. <laughs> Lean down and, and kiss me. Right Lean down and kiss me. Oh, no.